there's a danger of having a hard time. Listen to this week's message. It'll bless your life. God bless you. I'm not going to give you that much power over my life to hold me back for what God has for me. The devil is a liar. You can go where the devil is. I'm going to be with God to do what God has called me to do. And I'm not going to let what you say about me, how you stab me in my back, how you talk about me, how you mistreat me, how you drag my name through the mud, keep me from loving you. Oh, God, I love you. And I Good morning and welcome to Grace Nation. Our services have been fabulous thus far. We'd like to welcome all of our visitors here on today and pray that you will have enjoyed the worship experience. And now for our news. Good morning, Grace Nation. If you desire to be baptized by our one and only Pastor Rodney Cutter, please see Sister Teresa Jennings or Sister Letitia Hamilton. Good morning, Grace Nation. On February 27th, we will be having a family game night at 6 p.m. We will have games like Bingo, Monopoly, Uno. Hope you happy hippo! See you there! On March 7th at 5 p.m., the Women of Grace will hold our monthly fellowship at the Outback Steakhouse, the downtown location. Please see Sister Paris Wilson or Sister Tasha Moss to sign up. We must have your name on the list to attend. On March 8th, the Women of Grace will be collecting donations for the safe shelter. Please stay after service today to get more information. Hello G&G family, this is Pastor Rodney Cutter and I want to invite you to a event that's coming up in April. On April the 24th, we will be going down to Jacksonville to the Potter's House International Ministries to have fellowship with our Bishop, Bishop Vaughn McLaughlin. And uh, it's an opportunity for us as a G&G family to go down and experience all that they have to offer down there in Jacksonville. Also, during this particular trip, we're asking all our leaders to join us. We'll be staying over to the morning of the 25th, which is Saturday morning, and Bishop will be doing a one-on-one -on -one session with all of our leaders. Uh, so we're looking forward to you joining us over that particular weekend down in Jacksonville. Listen, see Sister Teresa Jennings leaders concerning accommodations because there will be a small nominal fee to cover your room and board and transportation for those of you who will not be driving. God bless you and I'm looking forward to us receiving this divine impartation from our spiritual leader, Bishop Vaughn Monroe McLaughlin. God bless you, G&G. &G. We love you. And men of grace, if you have a lady in waiting that is in middle school or high school, then listen up. This event is just for you. On February 28th, here at Growing in Grace Ministries, from 12 to 2 p.m., we will be hosting a lunch with our princess. The event is $15 per person. Please see Sister Sean Stewart, me, and Sister Nina Hunter for more information. On February 20th at 7 p.m., Growing in Grace Ministries will be worshiping with Starlight Ministries as we celebrate with them their pastor's anniversary. Pastor Cutter is the guest speaker. Do you have a hard heart? What's the status of your heart? What causes a hard heart? Listen to part two of the message from last Sunday for Wednesday night. God bless you and get ready. Today, we're going to talk about the signs of a hard heart. God bless you, G&G &G family. Yeah. He says, when you see my blessings, don't hard your hearts because your heart is bent towards what's popular, what's acceptable in the hour in which you live in. Okay. The children of Israel, in the midst of the wilderness, experienced everything it took to get them out of Egypt. Found themselves in a place to where they had to make a decision concerning what God said was rightfully theirs. God says, Go into the promised land. 
Thank you for watching our news, and we pray that you will enjoy the rest of our services. Please visit us on Facebook or go to our webpage at www.royalandgraceministries.net. Thank you and have an awesome day in Jesus.